Welcome to Clear Path Guidance and Tarot. All right, so I'm going to do a reading on Dilaraba and Lei Zhang. Someone had asked me to do a reading on these two just to see where things are, and um, I thought it'd be kind of fun. Match her with somebody else and see how that, how what what cards come up with that. Um, for anybody who is new to my channel, a little bit about myself. I'm a clairsentient, clairvoyant, and so I can pick up energies between people. Um, I can pick up uh, vibes, emotions, and I can kind of feel where a situation is going to go or a relationship. All right. If anybody out there is interested in, in purchasing a private reading from me, please email me. I will have my email below. Go ahead. I will get back to you within 24 hours. I offer three different services. The first one is one question. Uh, five cards energy reading for $30. Second service is two questions. You get five cards per question. Energy reading $45. And a full reading is $70. And um, with that, you get maximum four questions and again, cards and energy reading. Okay. Um, my turnaround time is less than seven days. So if you purchase, I will have the reading back to you in less than seven days. Um, uh, if you just want to have one question on your favorite celebrity or if you should take a job or why you and your mother don't get along or if somebody is interested in you, you can purchase the one question or get a whole whole reading. Okay. Uh, for those of you who keep coming back to my channel, I totally so appreciate it. Um, the support that I get from each and every single last one of you. I've had someone actually send me links of my videos in China. I guess there is a YouTube version in China and somebody has my readings of like Shen Yu and Dylan, Dylan Wang um, in China of me. So I, I can't believe that my videos have gone as far as China. So I appreciate for all, all of you who um, watch the the videos in China. I'd like to say hi to all the Chinese people there that do not have access to YouTube and someone has been creative enough um, to be able to download it and then load it onto this other other website or this other social media network. So okay so Lei Zhang he is a Libra and Dilaraba she is um, a, a Gemini. Now I don't know if they are together or not, but I feel like if they were, they would make a really great couple. He is nothing like Yang Yang, okay? Yang Yang is very refined, and he's a great actor, and he is charming. This guy is trouble. <laughs> this guy is exciting. I feel that he's fun, he's exciting, he's charismatic, he likes to have fun. And I really think that 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 if they got together, him and Dilaraba would have quite the spark. Um, I'm looking at I'm just looking at his face, and I just feel like he's a very um, there's something about him that is adorable, but I get kind of like a bad boy vibe from this guy, and I feel that he would bring the excitement to Dilaraba into her life. Like Yang Yang, I'm not saying he's a bad guy. I'm I'm saying he's a really good guy, but this guy has some sort of a factor that Yang Yang does not have. And he is um I don't know. I just feel like he's a little bit more on the wild side. And I think that if him and Dilaraba got together, um that they would he he, he would I think there there would be a flame here. And this flame could turn into something more, more of a raging fire maybe, because I think that um, he would show her a good time. You know, let's just see what the cards say. What are the energies between Lei Zhang and Dilaraba? Now I, I, ty I typed in Zhang uh, Yixing and up comes Lei Zhang. It says Zhang Yixing. I hope I'm saying that right. Um, known professionally as Lei Zhang or simply Lei. Oh, he's Korean. Okay. I think that he, um, 
I just, I don't know. I get, I get a good time from this guy. I feel like this guy would show Dilaraba a different side of life. You know, fun side on, on some level. You know, excitement. Okay, what what are the energies between Lei Zhang and Dilaraba? I don't feel like they're dating, but I think they should. I think that they would have a lot of fun together. Okay. All right, so the way I do my card readings is I shuffle till one card falls out. Those are clarity cards and jumpers. If more than one card falls out, I put it in the deck, put it back in the deck, and then shuffle till the one card falls out. Okay, there's the chariot. What are the messages between Lei Zhang? Energies between Lei Zhang and Dilaraba. We have the Four of Pentacles. Because I think, when I think about Dilaraba, um, I get someone, like I've said before, she reminds me of Angelina Jolie. She doesn't remind me of the run-of-the-mill actress. She reminds me of someone who wants to take, um, uh, um, risks. And I feel like this guy and her would take risks together. Okay, there's the Queen of Cups. All right, I've got two cards here again. What are the energies between them? What are the energies between them? Okay, what would the energies be? I think there is an element of, of um, uh, like they are attracted. I feel like they would be, they're attracted to each other, okay? Energies. What are the energies? Okay. So, I mean, here we have this card. There's the devil card. This talks about attraction. Okay. This talks about, um, uh, uh, you can see here, you know, our two people. There's the devil. I don't think that either of them are the devil. This is, this has nothing to do with the devil. It just has, this is an attraction. This can be intense between the two of them. I just don't know if they've connected, okay? I don't feel like these cards are saying that they haven't connected, but if they did, there would be um, an intense attraction between the two of them. That's what I feel, okay? That's what I'm picking up. So the devil speaks about um, uh, temptation, okay? I feel like there would be a temptation here between the two of them, okay? Now it stands for... illicit affairs um but it I mean I don't think it's either of that stuff because I don't I don't think that's going on but I do feel that this is um some sort of um temptation between the two of them that that they there is uh, an attraction okay all right more like animal magnetism you know um now that's that's the card that I pick up here I know it's not the first card, but that's the first card that came up that, that stood out to me is that attraction, okay? Now, we have the Queen of Cups. We know that she is not a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, but he could view her as a woman that is nurturing, she's helping, she's healing, she's supportive. I feel like she would be all that, okay? they These two are very two different people with, I think, two different lifestyles but it's like opposites attract. I feel like these two would be like opposites attracting, okay? Um, the Chariot. This talks about action and change. This does talk about a journey. This is about um, making a decision and then moving on from that decision, okay? So this card speaks about progress, victory, determination, mastery, so this card says um, you have that like they have to make a decision and move forward, okay? Now, 
relate if this says relationships progress you commit or journey on alone determined to follow your calling I think that he would be interested in her but don't think he's made a move but I think he knows he's attracted to her and would like to get to know her better but I don't think she wants any change there's the four of pentacles this talks about a desire for long-term security fear of change what's this woman doing she's holding on to the pentacle she wants that security she wants the money and that's not being greedy okay that is somebody that is working hard you can see and I think it and I feel like it's her never mind it's got a woman here I feel like it's her just earning she wants to make her way in um, the acting world and in her career and there's a fear of change here it's like a fear of it being taken away you can see she's clutching this these these pentacles and there's a fear of it being taken away from her so this is what she wants to focus on okay all right and then we have the five of cups so I feel like this might be him this is feeling unloved maybe his fear of being um, abandoned unloved loss that sort of a thing um I don't know if they've met before or not if they have I feel like this would be like fun between the two of them like if they have any kind of a relationship I really feel that this is an easy relationship but I don't feel he has made any moves because I get that he feels somewhat um uh maybe that she might be out of his league okay but he should try because I really feel that this would be a, a fun relationship I think they would both have fun um, in this relationship together okay all right so there is the reading on Dilaraba uh, uh, Dilmarat and Lei Zhang I don't think there's anything going on I think that they should try and date because I I really feel that there's some sort of an attraction here between the two of them all right okay everybody thank you for so much for watching my channel, sharing, liking, subscribing. I truly appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.